don't have some for a drop experience design working with the nice uh, icons for a drop experience so for example we create a new uh, for ipad does not matter and we want to create a new button with the angle we just make use this rectangle without the shift yeah this is my mistake and for example yeah, button. here we can do we can also use the nice feature in the grid so it can fit to our grid and here we want to make some text go to home for example and we want to use also some icon here so the first I change the color so it sound nice button with the ground color here I have a plus button where and I can save a color uh, to my templates templates and I can work with this later uh, just by selecting here not finding with the exact color so for example like this go to home and here I want to put some icon uh, for this you need to go to font Epsom for example or another font you need to download it just download open a zip files and then you can just open the fonts and you can install this font uh, that's okay you just install the font I have it already installed so no problem uh, now we go to icons I don't know where it's in the navigation here uh, I can find it but I know that this is the cheat cheat sheet and in fact it's not in navigation uh, it's stupid a little bit so we go to cheat, uh, cheat sheet and from here we can copy any icon so here is the home we just select this icon copy it with command C and we just uh, paste it here as a text and as you can see it's not found because it's a Helvetica and in Helvetica there is no such icon so we use font Epson select the size we select the color and we have our icon here and now we have our button for example we can uh, also the we can also hide the grid so we have button it's not so nice it should be a bit like this so now we have blue button with the icon and I suggest you to group them and also when you group to write button go to home and then you can easy work with them uh, you can also show the grid uh, just use the short key hotkeys the command and single quote so uh, now if you want to make another button you just copy it and change to, uh, for example logout logout and we have a logout button it's much smaller and we want to change this icon we also go here and 
we don't have logout. Sometimes I just search here because here is search much much better but I cannot copy from this table I need to find out the correct word here and copy it so now we have two icons two buttons with two icons and this button need to be renamed so that's the easy way how to use the font of some icons or other icons in your design thank you for watching